Welcome guys to another episode on the Extra Mile. My name is Alex and welcome to another Assetto Corsa Competizione episode. A new patch has been released and of course we have to try it out. I'm standing here in the pit lane of Monza uh, with one of the two new cars. Both of them are Nissan GTRs. They're just two different model years. Uh, but yeah, this should be fun. Um, thank you guys very much for being here, for liking and subscribing, hopefully. And if you want to get in touch, you can check out the Discord channel, which I've linked in the description. Um, but anyway, on to the car. Let's take a closer look here before we uh, take it out for a spin. I gotta say, it looks really, really good, almost photorealistic. I don't know if they have worked on the shaders or the textures, but it looks absolutely incredible. Look at those details here at the front wheel alone. The tire texture looks amazing. Really, really, really good stuff. Uh, yeah, I like what I'm seeing here. Um, anyway, let's, uh, let's take this car out for a spin and see how she drives. All right, here we are in the car. First thing that we have to do is switch on the ignition. We can hear the fuel pump working and let's fire her up. Okay, that's pretty good, I would say. Let's uh, turn off the traction control and give this a shot. So, uh, first impressions, um, I think the visuals are slightly, whoa, slightly improved. Um, except for the track, it's maybe more the car that looks better. The cockpit looks a little bit clearer, all the textures look a little bit sharper, but maybe that's just me. Maybe that is placebo. Um, what is not so great is the visibility in the distance. Uh, I said a Corsa, for example, is much, much sharper in the distance and less pixelated. But um, I'm sure that that will... Isn't there a bridge here, usually? I'm confused. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, I'm sure that this can be still further improved over the course of the development. Sound of the GTR is as good as it was in the other cars, which means very, very, very good. In fact, the sound, whoa, is the best thing about Assetto Corsa Competizione so far. It's really very, very, very good. I don't know if they have improved it, I assume they have. It feels very, very lifelike, very heavy and weighty. Great feedback. For speedback, it's really very good. Very, very good indeed. Let's listen to that reverb from the engine. The track itself, I don't know what it is, but it still looks a little bit more like a comic than real life and I'm almost positive that there was a bridge here. I'm so confused right now. I have to check this track in Assetto Corsa. But yeah, the track itself, it's, uh, it's not looking great. The more I drive the car, the more I feel at home in it, the more I trust it. And Assetto Corsa Competizione certainly has that intuitive handling that Assetto Corsa is known for. The cars themselves are still not really my cup of tea. I prefer road going sports cars but 
they certainly are good fun. Whoa! Whoa! I could have catched that! God damn it! That was a crash! <laughs> Alright! Okay, let's uh, use this opportunity and do another launch. <laughs> okay, it's good fun. Yeah, I gotta say, uh, the track visuals in general are probably the worst part for me about the Fender Porta Competizione right now. Um, it just... Part of it is the pixelation in the distance that you do not get in a set of Corsa, for example. Another part is uh, the color combination and the textures. Yeah, it just does not look great. There's no way of, of getting around that. Um, I remember the first preview shots of a set of Corsa Competition that we've seen a year or so ago and they look awesome. And this does not look like that at all. Um, so who knows, maybe it will at the end of the development cycle. But so far, the car visuals far surpass the track visuals, in my humble opinion. Anyway, let's go for one more lap. One fast one. Yeah, the car looks absolutely fantastic, though. Okay, 150, brake hard. Stay in second gear. Apex, that apex, easy on the throttle. Come on, look at that wall to our left here, for example. I mean, it, it looks shitty. Bad, low res textures, it just looks out of place. I don't know. I mean, this is another example. Look at that. Look at that texture. What resolution is that? 24 by 24? I mean, I mean, that's... It looks like shit. <sighs> yeah, I mean, it's... it's. I, want, I don't want to sound too harsh here, but... I mean, for a game that's releasing in 2019, I think you have to look better than that. I actually think a set of Corsa looks better than that. We really have to do a detailed comparison between this track in a set of Corsa Competizione and a set of Corsa. I want to see that. Because from what I remember, a set of Corsa did not look this bad in terms of the track at least. Ooh, a little bit of almost here. Okay. Anyway, this was a very quick first look at a set of course a competition. Let's go for one last lap. Let's try to make it a fast one. One last one. 150 break. Down into second gear. Hit the first apex. Hit the second apex. Easy on the throttle. Whoa! <laughs> okay! <laughs> that costs a little bit of time. But that's alright. And break at 150. Into second gear. Keep as much speed as we can through the chicane. That was not too bad. Come on, come on, come on.
There we go, there we go. Yeah, if only the track would look better or would look as good as the car does, then it would be a whole different ball game. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Probably could have taken that a little bit faster, but that was alright. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Let's break at the 100 into third. And accelerate early. That was a decent lap at least. 155.1. Alright, I think that should do it. Let's finish things off with a nice burnout. Because why wouldn't we? Second gear. Second gear it is. <laughs> okay, I felt a little bit weird. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed watching. Let me know what you think of Assetto Corsa Competizione so far. Let me know what you think of the track visuals. Am I crazy? Am I imagining things? Um, anyway, we will do a detailed comparison between Monza in Assetto Corsa and in Assetto Corsa Competizione and uh, see where that leads us. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching and I hope you have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.